Hello everyone, my name is ForensicX3 and today we're going to learn how to add a jump sound into our game. So, I have a simple scene set up here, all it has is uh, the Invector third person controller, that's it. Now, it doesn't have any sound. Uh, I want it to have sound. So, I want there to be a jump sound, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to find my jump sound, if I can find it here really quick. I have uh, a lot of stuff. Uh, jump.wav, there you go. Uh, this is meant for a 2D game, so it is going to sound off place. Yeah, so it's going to sound off place, but that does not matter. So what we're going to do, we're going to put this in our scene. So now it's in our scene. We're going to toggle off, play on awake, and we are going to add a new component. I'm going to call this, uh, we're going to add a new script. Jump. That's all we're going to name it. Now we're going to open that up in Visual Studio and we are gonna delete this void start and we are gonna add a public audio source so public jump is all I'm gonna call it and now we're going to go to this void update, and we're going to put if input, let me move my mouse there, dot get key down key code dot space. And now we're going to go down here and we're going to do jump dot play. So that's all I believe we need. So if we go into here and we, oh, we have a compiler error. So let's see what we did wrong here. Input, I spelled input wrong. Forgot the U, I believe. Yep. So now, it doesn't work. So, what did we do wrong here? So we're gonna open up this and we see this jump uh, public audio source. We're gonna drag this audio source into here. Now, if we press space, you can see it works. Now, this method is very flawed, but is it, it is really the only method that I know since I'm fairly new to coding. So, uh, if you guys would, if any of you guys really know how to code, please tell me in the comments uh, another good way to do this. But, uh, if you're just starting out, this is a very simple way to make, like, a beta test game. You know, if you're just gonna test a few things, and, yeah. So, this is a pretty good way to do that. So, uh, I hope you guys learned something from this, and, uh, if you did, leave a message in the comments below. Uh, and I hope you guys enjoyed, and goodbye.